the immune imbalance, which mostly caused by the overactive adaptive immunity, or T helper 1, or TH1, and T helper 2, or TH2 response, is the root of most modern diseases. People who have problems with excessive activation of the type 1 and type 2 immunity and their control are more likely to get rapid aging and chronic illness, for example, heart diseases, obesity, diabetes, dementia, Alzheimer's disease, thyroid Hashimoto, Crohn's disease, Parkinson, multiple sclerosis, rheumatoid arthritis, lupus, HIV, and cancer. A healthy immune system should be balanced between T helper 1 and T helper 2 activities. The first nine months of human life develops in the womb. Everyone is born with the innate immunity or specific immunity from mother. Cells of the innate immunity such as macrophages, natural killer cells, neutrophils provide immediate defense against infection. As we grow, our bodies develop our own immunity, that is, the adaptive immunity or the Th1 media cellular type 1 immunity and Th2 mediate humoral type 2 immunity, which works as the normal police officers. They patrol in the body to search out and destroy the targeted invaders. Our bodies continue developing T helper cells. At 20 years old, the T helper cells are at their highest level and gradually decreasing until we have reached 70 years old. Then our body stops producing it. Only the remaining can be utilized until the final day of life. The innate immunity which we get from mother is developed similar to the special force unit or a SWAT team. Cells of the innate immunity include of macrophages, natural killer cells, neutrophils, help to present antigens to the T cells immunity, which are so called the sleeping immunity, but very powerful. This potent sleeping T cells immunity will not function until they have received the specific signal or antigen presentation to wake them up. Then, they activate the T helper cells further sign the B cells to produce antibodies to fight against the foreign materials that are perceived to be harmful and eradicate them all. Getting a child vaccinated will leave the child's body with a supply of T cells, B cells, and antibody. Then, with our innate immunity, the immune system will remember how to fight against the disease in the future. Sangwal mushroom is known as the mushroom which grows on the living mulberry and elm trees for over a thousand years in the deep forests. There is an old saying, if you are able to find a yellow lump that grows on a mulberry tree, then you can save a dying person and bring him back to life. Among the active components contained in the natural sangwong are polysaccharides beta-glucan-1316, tetrapinoids, twenty essential amino acids, nucleic acids, According to the Chinese history, in year 220 BC, the great Emperor Qin sent 3,000 boys and girls to Japan's island to search for a kind of thousand-year-old Lingzi mushroom, which is known as a mushroom of immortality. Sang Huang Lingzi was believed to be the one.
In 1945, there were the atomic bombings of the cities of Hiroshima and Nagasaki, Japan. Ash, flame burns, radiation sickness, and cancer killed many people. After the devastation, the Japanese government mandatory evacuated the affect victims to the islands for isolation, so the victims could be monitored and observed for the accurate treatment. However, the people who moved and lived on the Mishima Island, including Kuroshima, Aojima, and Tageshima, were getting better and better, day by day. After many researches and clinical practice, scientists found out that the sick people consumed the kind of mushroom that grew on the mulberry tree on a regular basis. That was how Japanese scientists started out the first cancer research on the natural feeling of Lintia's mushroom. In 1964, Japanese scientists started the first research on the natural Philinus mushroom, and the first Philinus mushroom was found in Mishima and Kagoshima Islands, Japan. In 1968, the marvelous effects of Philinus lintius was reported in Japan National Cancer Center on its cancer inhibition ratio of 96.7%. In 1980, Korean scientists also started the research on natural Philinus lintius medicinal properties and mycelium cultivation. In 1992, Philinus lintius became the national project of Korea for its curing effect on cancer. In 1993, Philinus lintius has the Korean FDA approval. It has been sold in Korean market since then. Amazing Grass Health Products was established in 2002. It has been focused on research of the natural Philinus lintius medicinal properties. According to the researchers, only the natural fruiting body of Philinus lindius has the miracle curing effects. Amazing Grass strongly believes that the use of the top quality parts of the correct species of the natural Philinus mushroom, which needs to grow on a minimum of 30 to 40 years under perfect growth conditions, is very essential because they will offer the potential health benefits. Currently, there are over 470 species of Philinus mushroom, and only two species have many scientific researches on the most significant health benefits. They are Philinus lintius and Philinus ignirius. In 2004, Thai Korea Natural Philinus and Cordyceps Militaris Mushroom Research Center Founded by collaboration between Amazing Grass Health Products and Professor Dr. Ji Mo Song, the pioneer scientist on the natural cordyceps mushroom from Kangwon National University, Korea. We are now working in collaboration with the 20 renowned scientists from the leading international institutions from Hong Kong, Japan, Korea, and Thailand. During the past 10 years, we have applied scientific research and showed that the pharmaceutical activities of amazing gross products include of antioxidative, anti-inflammatory, anti-fungal, anti-cancer, immunomodulatory, hepatotoxicity protection, neuroprotective, and UV protection. Amazing Grass Health Products together with the Thai Korea Natural Philinus Mushroom Research Center will continue on to more advanced studies on the variety of medicinal applications of the natural Philinus mushroom. 
This is for the development of new medicines in order to save lives, especially from diseases which cannot be cured by modern medicine, and for a better quality of life. <laughs>